Hello everyone, welcome back to the .NET office. In this video, we are going to discuss about NJF versus hidden in Angular 50. So when we talk about the hidden, so in the HTML side, when we give a hidden to any paragraph or something like if I want to show or hide a particular paragraph or div, then we go with the hidden attribute. Similar to that, in this video, what we are going to discuss, what is the difference between NGIF and the hidden? So if we talk about the difference between them, so when we see Angular NGIF directive, seems to be just like the HTML5 hidden, hidden attribute. So why do we need two ways to do the same thing? That is the question. Like if both are the same thing, then do we need in the uh, like uh, Angular side, this NGIF is required. So the main difference between these two is basically like when we write the hidden, so it just hidden that particular uh, paragraph uh, or like the text on the browser, but it doesn't delete that particular DOM from the uh, background. So that is the main difference. But when we use the ng if, so in that case, what happened like it uh, delete or remove that particular div or the paragraph from the HTML side. So that is the main difference between them because they both are completely different concepts. The hidden attribute is literally hiding the selected part of the DOM, just like CSH display none property. The element still sit on the DOM. They are just invisible from the page. So let's understand it with an example. So here we have this NGF and here what I'm going to do, I'm going to take one paragraph and here I'm saying this is .NET office this i'm writing and here what i'm going to do like as i'm saying here i'm going to use the hidden for this one so let's use hidden attribute so that is hidden and what i'm going to do here we have one variable called visible so let's make it as a uh, this visible here now let's save it so currently let's make it as a true and it is both are the true if we'll go on the browser okay so it is not coming let's see and the reason is it is not showing here like we have to uh, remove this one okay so hidden visible and that is false so let's go like uh, visible false we are making it here so we can see it is showing here so both the dom element is currently showing now what i am going to do i am going to hide these two so here what I'm going to do, I'm going to make it as a um, like this. And here what I'm going to do, I'm going to make it as a 10. So let's save it. And we can see both are not visible now. Let's go to the inspect element and let's see for both. So this is the app route. So let's here and let's increase little size of this. So here this is the app route. If I will expand this. So here you can see. It is showing this is my first Angular 15 application. So that is the aesthetic text. We are not putting any condition for this one. But here we can see like for hidden. This is .NET Office. If you will see here, this is .NET Office. This is the paragraph we are using the hidden. So from the DOM element, it is just what it is doing. It is just making visible false from here. But it is still exist in the DOM element. Now, if we talk about the NGF, we can see it is not exist in the DOM element as well. So that is the main difference between the NGF and the header. So that's it for this video. If you have any question and doubt, please comment. Thank you.